Comcast Center in College Park, Maryland. The Cavaliers of Virginia come into Maryland's house and walk away with a win. The final was 80-69. Welcome back inside, everybody. Tim Brandt along with Dan Bonner, and this was a terrific ball game played by the Cavaliers of Virginia. Shot better than 50%, and that was including beyond the arc. Tim, they played great offense, and this is a Virginia team that typically plays really good defense, and they did that today, but their offense was just outstanding, and their three-point offense was about as good as you can expect. Jesperson, who didn't score in the first half, made four threes in the second half. The Cavaliers overall made 11 three-point baskets. Nolte hit a couple. Joe Harris had three three-pointers. Even Justin Anderson hit a three-point basket. So the Cavaliers, they were 11 for 19 from out there. Just an outstanding shooting performance. Virginia led by six at the half. They built that lead to 14 points. Maryland never got closer than seven. And Dan had a chance to talk with Tony Bennett. Tony Bennett, your team comes into Maryland and gets a big road win. That's something you have not had a lot of success with. What was the key today? I think we held on. We ran played good offense. Um, you know, I think we had too many turnovers. You saw that. We had a little trouble handling them off the dribble. They got to the rim in the second half, but we had enough composure. Guys shot the ball well. We, we shared it and, and, you know, came up with enough stops to be successful against a team that's deep. And when we got in foul trouble in the first half, we were concerned. How big a problem was that in the first half? Because in the second half, when Akil Mitchell comes back, he played very well for you. How concerned were you with those fouls? We were because without Mike Toby, he's recovering from mono right now. We don't have size. Darion was kind of a game time decision to get a few minutes and use a little rusty. You could see that. So um, we were just trying to ham and egg it and keep it together. And um, they uh, they had a sometimes match with us, though, too, when we went with the four guards. But we got hurt in areas, and hopefully we can keep a keel out of foul trouble. Well, now you're talking about ham and egg, and it. I think ham and egg both was Justin Anderson. He, I, he guarded about everybody on the court. Yeah, Justin's versatile, and I knew coming back you know having committed here that uh it'd be a, a challenge in some ways but i thought he rose to the occasion and he's full of life and energy and i'm glad he's with us thank you very much tony congratulations thanks dan it's all virginia today they jump out to a six point halftime lead expounded upon that 80 69 the final the cavaliers beat maryland in college park